don't, I don't, uh, I'll try to be honest with it. Um, I had been contacted by a man named uh, Riccio. Uh, he had contacted me over a period of time, told me that there was some guys that was trying to get him to fence my property, uh, and he thought I should come and get it. Well, I kind of blew him off because I'm really not interested in football property. Uh, I don't collect memorabilia, only my own personal items. He was pretty consistent in calling me, and finally I told him, well, see if you can get pictures of what they have. He sent me some pictures, and what I saw was my family, my mother's albums, pictures of my kids growing up, uh, certificates of accomplishments of mine, uh, uh, pictures of what I call significant uh, famous people, uh, letters of myself. So I told him I would really like to get this stuff. So. After, um, after a period of time, through what he described in court as, uh, as a perfect storm, we all ended up in Las Vegas. <laughs> you know, I was there for a wedding, and he told me that the property was there. And would I like to try to get the property? I said, of course I would like to get the property. He told me the names of what he thought were the people in the room, and I realized these are friends of mine. You know, uh, actually guys who uh, helped me move, helped me move and store some of this stuff, right? So on the day of this incident, he came to my uh, hotel uh, to talk about how this would take place. I told him I met with a lawyer last night and my sister and my daughter and some other friends and discussed it. I pointed out another lawyer that was uh, at the poolside as a part of this um, wedding party that was going